With the Vulcan V12 being discontinued, I want the longest possible life for my engine. A major part of this is having a leak-free connection, so that I'm not constantly losing air while out in the field. So I wanted to make a video that just really quickly ran through how to replace and renew the macro air line inside of the Vulcan V12 engine. So the reason I want to replace my macro line is that since the Vulcan V12 is discontinued, I purchased mine from a previous owner. And the fitting inside the IGL that came with my Vulcan V12 has been eating away at the macro line, causing the possibility of a leak at that connection and an uneven seal. On top of this, I want to replace the IGL completely with the macro line fitting from Amped Airsoft. To open up the V12 engine shell, first remove the plastic tip from over the nozzle, and then remove all six of the hex screws surrounding the case. Keep in mind that there are multiple sizes, so you're going to want to keep your screws organized. And just like that, we can lift the top off of the shell. With a paper towel and some isopropyl alcohol, I just gently clean some areas where I find dirt and grease. Alright, so here is the open engine. The area in which the macro line slides into the engine is located right here. This connection is a quick detach connector, meaning simply pushing this ring in will release the macro line tubing. you need even pressure on the ring from both sides. So to do this, I gently pull the cylinder just out of the casing so that I can rotate it with the macro line pointing straight up in the air. From here, I can use both hands to gently apply pressure downward on the release ring, and then using my teeth to grab the macro line from on top, I can pull it straight out. The macro line will come right out with some slight pressure while the ring is being pushed down. Now you can rest the cylinder back in the shell, as inserting the new line is much easier. When inserting the new macro line, be sure that both ends are cut straight across and not at an angle as shown here on screen. I flipped my macro line around and used the perfectly straight across end. Simply inserting the new macro line into the quick detach connector will secure the connection. Push with some pressure. You will feel the macro line push into the connector and lock into place. I purchased my extra macro line directly from Vulcan. It costs about 38 cents per foot. From here, just guide the hose down into the slot for the motor grip, and the shell is ready to be put back together. You can cut the remaining macro line down to however short you need it, and by reattaching your IGL or your HPA fitting, you are good to go with a brand new macro line installed. I hope this was helpful for any V12 owners out there. Thanks for checking out the video, guys. As always, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe to stay in the loop with all things Airsoft, and I'll see you guys in the next one.